Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Tracy and I'm back for another video. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. And I usually do bag videos and some vlog videos. So welcome to my channel. As you can see, there's a Macy's box here. And yes, we're going to do another unboxing video from Macy's. Yes, from Macy's. For, this is a big box. But when I read the item, like Macy's will send you an email that your item has been delivered. The item looks smaller. The box is big. So it's so lightweight. I can, like, I can hear it's like moving inside if I shake it. It has a lot of room. But anyway, I have a big box from Macy's. Let's proceed to the unboxing. Yes. Unboxing again. I hope guys you're not getting tired of me doing unboxing videos. I enjoy buying bags when they're on sale. I think this bag I purchased during their last, I think I can't remember what's the promo during that time. Like 60% off. So, Here it is. Here's the item I got. Yep. It's not big. It's small. Yeah, it is small. I think it's like, I paid like, how much did I pay for this one? $68 including tax for this one because it was on sale and extra 30% off, I think. I'm not 100% sure, but it was 60% off when I purchased this. And let's look at the box look at the size of the box and the bag <laughs> sometimes they send you bags that are big that they try to fit in a small box and other times they will send you a big box with a tiny bag inside hmm. Macy's packaging uh, anyway let's continue with our bag it doesn't look brand new from the factory. Just as you can see, there's no factory packaging. Let's open this up. This is a nylon. I think this is a nylon bag. This is not a leather bag. I think Macy still has this on their website, but it is $82, I believe. Still on sale, but it's not as cheap as when I purchased this one. This is cute though. Look at that. Oh, by the way, this is a bag from Radley London. There you go. Radley London. This is cute. The dog. I think they're si that's their signature, their logo, I guess. I'm new to Radley London. Uh, I purchased one last during my um, huge Macy's haul. And I haven't used that one. I still have to make a video of that. That's my very first Radley London. And then this is the second one. So, I'm looking at their, their Radley London bag with the, like a painting, like a drawing of a dog. So I'm still waiting for that to go on sale. Once it go on sale, I'll purchase that one. So this bag is the Radley London Sketchy Floral Medium Zip Top Bright white yes this is the bag oh my god still has the this is nice so this is not leather it looks like you know the Safiano leather kind of so I'm not 100% sure if this is a leather bag but it says there so I'm looking right now at the Macy's website and this is made of nylon slash Prada nylon. Oh, Prada nylon. I wonder what that is. It's so cute. It's so springy. Why did I just... Yeah, it looks so springy. But I think I can still wear it during fall because of the black. Yes, I think I can still wear it during fall. Look at the design. Look at the flower detail. There's Radley London here. And then at the back. There's a pocket here. Oh, that's cute. There's a pocket. Let's try the phone. Let's try my phone to it'll fit in there. 
it's nice you know like you can use it at crossbody and then you can just slip your phone in there I like that feature this is the price of the bag if you will pay full price and then the bottom the bottom has no feet but it has a leather strip I hope this is leather but maybe not so let's look at the it looks like a leather material but it says Prada nylon so maybe that's that's the material for that but I am not sure I bought this side because it was in, on sale and it looks cute I'm more of like a brown plain bag kind of person but I'm trying to venture to like more adding more color to my bags instead of like having just a saddle color so there you go this is the shoulder strap it doesn't feel like a high quality shoulder strap but we'll see in time when I start using this and it's adjustable so this is the adjustment this is how you adjust it you just pull it and make it shorter it can be like a shoulder bag then I'll show it to you later what it looks like when we make it short shorter so let's go at the inside of the bag oh let me show you the I'm all, all over the place so cute I don't know what the color for this one it looks like peach peachy pink peachy pink so it has gold hardware and then the zipper closure has a small leather detail there. And let's look at the inside. It is stuff. Stuff. So the inside has like a nylon, nylon lining. And zipper pocket here. Your pocket here uh, big enough not not too small not too big and look at the Radley London inside their logo and then on the other side it has two uh, slip compartments probably for your phone let's try it phone will fit in there yep the phone can fit in there and then on the other side and then it will not fit on the other pocket only this side i think this this bag can fit a lot this let's try putting stuff in it okay uh i have here a nolita nolita coach nolita let's put everything that we can fit in here i have a hello kitty pouch i have a full size wallet. I got a slim wallet. I got a power bank. <laughs> this is never ending. Even if it's small, I can fit a lot. A card case, another card case, another wallet. A card case and a coin purse <laughs> look how stuff it is and let's close it let's close it look at that look at that I like it I like it. it's not so big but it's not super tiny and it fits a lot really a lot you can fit inside and I still have more room like if I want to put my sunglasses with case eyeglasses with case it's still it I still have room for this so now let's do this is a very simple bag straightforward not much of a lot of, not a lot of detail to it so that's now let's proceed to the mud shots so let's put it on the longest setting put it that way and 
it's lower than my hips. If I wear it crossbody, that's what it looks like. It's good for traveling. This is a nice bag for traveling. I like it. I really like this bag. Let's try it to a little shorter. Let's make it a little shorter. I adjust it to that much. And so this is good for a shoulder bag length. If we put it as a crossbody, like that. Like if you have small kids and you don't want to bring a like a diaper bag, this is a good size bag. So now we're on the shortest setting. And okay, this is what it looks like. I cannot do the crossbody anymore, but yes, when you wear it like a shoulder bag, it still looks good. So this bag has a top handle, which is nice, like when you put it in your car, it's easy to grab and go for bags with the, with the handle. And then if you don't want to wear it like a crossbody, you can just keep the strap like this. It looks nice. You just carry it like that. The hook of your arm. There you go. This is our unboxing video for today. Our 